So I knew there was something about this hand-painted tile just because it was embossed. Can't see it in the uh, video or photographs. Um, it's hard to tell without touching it. But it's got a large crack from the 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock position running up to the 1 o'clock position. I don't know if it's loose or if it's been repaired. So I kind of do have to crack it out of this 1950s do-it-yourself home frame. And give me one second, let me flip it over. I did hear something loose in the background um, with a piece of paper sticking out. So let me show you, I just cracked one corner and let me show you what I found. So this thing weighs about over 10 pounds inside of the wood frame, which I think the wood frame weighs between one and two pounds. So it is a heavy antique tile. My friend was able to date it to the 18th century. He was able to find the palace that it came from, uh, Persian descent. And uh, yeah, let me show you here. So I was able to get a, one corner up. You do see some historical documents in there, newspapers, probably information about the piece. But uh, I had to be really careful with this, so well, let me show you when I get this back panel off. So that didn't really pop off the way I wanted it to pop off, and uh, well, that's okay. Let's see what we got here. I should be wearing gloves for this, kind of. So we got some sort of Arabic text, newspapers. It's kind of in line with what the piece would would have you know I thought this was going to be information about the piece but it's kind of looking like it's just padding for the back of it since it is a ceramic porcelain tile there I needed to see the back of this tile anyway but this isn't looking like any information about about it, so kind of take back my 1950s framing. This might be uh, 1930s style paper here. And there's the back of the tile. Looks like it's been glued once already. Corner wear, but. That is one hell of a thick tile. Probably one inch thick. I'm kind of scared to move it out of this framing. 